in looking more carefully at the imagery of Tombaugh Regia or the heart. Uh, like a real heart, it has uh, two lobes on the left and, and on the right side. The left is the western side. And I think even to your eye, you can distinguish a difference between those two. The right lobe looks like a much thinner deposit that's been painted on top of the topography. And our interpretation of that, that material in the right lobe as well as the material emanating to the south below the western lobe is that um, in both cases, we believe the source for that material is the western lobe, that its material is being bright material, probably nitrogen snow, is being transported off the source region of the western lobe. This is one of our first images of Pluto's atmosphere. Now, this was the image that stunned the encounter team. For 25 years, we've known that Pluto has an atmosphere, but it's been known by numbers. This is our first picture. This is the first time we've really seen it. This was the image that almost brought tears to the eyes of the atmospheric scientist on the team. Those haze particles are chemically processed to, pr to produce what we call tholins, which are chemically, uh, chemically altered hydrocarbons that have a red color. And we think that that is how Pluto's surface got its reddish hue.